Robin Morton, contributor to the sport. Philadelphia native Robin Morton started her involvement with cycling when her husband Glenn began racing with the Pennsylvania Bicycle Club in Chestnut Hill, Philadelphia in 1980. 2014 Bicycling Hall of Fame inductee Jerry Casal was the president of the club at the time and he became Robin's mentor as she assisted with the amateur racing team and club races. Robin moved from amateur cycling to the professional ranks by organizing the GEOS team for the inaugural Tour of America in 1983. In 1984, Robin organized and registered a U.S. men's professional road racing team, making Robin the first female team director in the history of professional cycling. The team, sponsored by Gianni Mota, was the first U.S. team to enter a Grand Tour, the 1984 Giro d'Italia. At the time, European cycling rules prohibited women from the race caravan. Before each race, the organizers would vote on whether Robin could even be allowed to ride in the team car. The team she put together the following year in 1985, Xerox Benotto, was the first U.S. team to compete in the Vuelta a España, the Criterium du Dauphiné Libéré, and others. Robin managed teams for nine years, and her professional cycling teams competed throughout Europe, North, and South America. She then transitioned into event management, working with Jerry Casal and Dave Chowner at Threshold Sports for 17 years as the technical director for cycling events, which included professional national championships, UCI races, and the 1996 Atlanta Olympic and Paralympic Games. In 2005, Robin and Alice Armstrong founded G4 Productions, a women-owned event production company. They have organized races, non-profit fundraising rides, and the U.S. Professional Road Racing Championships, and the U.S. Masters and Paracycling National Championships. With her extensive team and event experience at the highest levels, Robin Morton has become a groundbreaking contributor to the sport of cycling.